Hello, my name is Voya and welcome to my deep guide and in today's video we are going to be revisiting the Superdote or Rata because they have had a recent announcement about something quite interesting. Remember this dude from my last Q&A who just went ahead and went like, hey, when will Supernote sell replacement stuff though? I know they talk all about future-proofing and battery swapping, but they don't sell any and he's not the only one. Well, guess what? They have just announced their DIY, do-it-yourself zone, where individuality is the raw power of creativity. And like I commented on, uh, yeah, in the Q&A when we talked about that, uh, issue. Uh, it just makes sense, the timing of all of this, how it goes. So just think about it. First, they had the Nomad come out with the entire new concept and feel right to and all that kind of stuff coming out and yeah, going on the market. Then a year later, Supernote Manta or the A5X2 comes out and now they have refreshed their product lineup and that's like, okay, so now now we're done and the next logical step in my mind would have been exactly this so here are our two products that we have to offer and here are the replacement parts that we currently have and that is the DIY zone so for me I think that this is an incredibly important and logical sequence of events that shows that basically yeah they are behind this venture and what they uh, yeah what they made so my comment about um, them not doing something like this would be akin to cutting your own foot and beating yourself to death with it it, well, yeah, it was as is logical as that action would have been because here we go. Now we have the DIY zone and they are offering, it's a limited offering, but it is starting, you know, so this is like the very basic startup of this whole thing and you have the batteries currently available only in the US but I guess they will figure stuff out because the battery transportation laws are different from uh, region to region but you do have batteries and when we go to batteries we do have the options for Manta and for Nomad right so right out of the get-go if you want to future proof and you are in the United States for now for the batteries you can order a spare battery and have it at your home right just in case in case something happens in three to five years to your trusty old uh, nomad and you want to replace the battery here it is you can order it and you can have it so the price is $65 for the battery for nomad and $85 for the Manta these are fairly pricey but you gotta kind of keep in mind that it's not just the battery but it's also the housing and the cable and everything so that it's fully easy to kind of implement in this whole thing and that you can do it at home you don't have to pay a service or anyone else to kind of open up the device and change the battery that's it that's your entire cost because you can do it by yourself at home um, so that's kind of nice thing to see what do they say about shipping time two to three weeks very very interestingly we also have the core x2 motherboard which is the same motherboard that both the nomad and the manta are using that's the soc and everything including the uh, micro sd card slot so all of it is just there and that entire uh, yeah replacement motherboard is 175 us dollars and this one is available everywhere i think all right so for shipping time they have different requirements and it says like after placing your motherboard order please use the email address associated with your order to send a video showing the serial number of your super note device that requires the motherboard replacement this allows us to configure the motherboard for your device and ensures it's ready to ship if you don't receive the serial number we will won't be able to ship your motherboard order we'll keep you updated on the shipping and the status so that uh, makes sense i think that that makes sense but that's also a really prudent way to protect themselves from somebody simply just ordering the yeah motherboard and a battery and then starting to make their own devices without owning actually um, a super node device so yeah you get 175 us dollars for the motherboard and how much was it for the battery for Manta 85 so that's uh, 180 so 260 bucks for the battery and the motherboard 
uh, overall. So that's fairly, fairly pricey. What else are they offering currently? Well, they're currently offering the enclosures or the back covers and the back cover for the Manta. So the piece of plastic with a bunch of little uh, uh, notches that hold it in place. It's 35 bucks. So we're talking about 260, 295, 295 bucks to get currently all three available spare parts for your Manta, almost 300 bucks or uh yeah that's a lot <laughs> that's that's really really a lot all right then for the nomad white edition 25 bucks and for the crystal edition 45 bucks so yeah the prices i think are are quite high which is usually the problem with uh, everything that supernote does and um yeah it reflects in these uh, spare parts as well however just think about it i mean you buy a device now or you bought like a nomad uh, a year ago or something like that and now you have the peace of mind that you know that you can just order a spare battery to have in place if you want and to me that just makes a heck of a lot of sense oh they do have the feel right to film as well which is 50 bucks for the a5 devices and 35 bucks for the a6 devices that's that's really really pricey uh, but yeah i think that this concept is something that uh, makes sense and yeah as far as the next logical steps well the next logical step is now that they have this going and when they see the logistics of it how it works what doesn't work what they can improve etc etc because i'm pretty sure that there's going to be like a learning curve to this aspect as well but the next thing to see is like okay so is there going to be like an x2 pro motherboard or i don't know like a x4 pro motherboard or something like that that is the exciting aspect of this uh, whole platform however if the core 2 motherboard costs 175 bucks that means that that is the starting position or the starting point as far as the prices goes for the upgradability of the um yeah of the super note and that's that's fairly high but as a concept they are delivering right so they, they delivered the a6 x2 or the nomad then they delivered after delays a5 x2 or the manta and the concept that these two introduced is the repairability and basically future proofing your device by offering upgradability by yourself no need for services no need for anything like that you can just do it yourself or you get somebody who's even a tiny little bit tech savvy to do it for you because it's a piece of cake to actually do something like that for somebody who deals with technology on any kind of level of basis and to me that's exciting that's exciting and it's very unique and that's something that you need in in today's um yeah marketplace you need a unique product placement unique selling point unique story something that differentiates you from other devices and i think that supernote has it in spades not just with this this is definitely a big thing and now they're proving it that it's not just a gimmick something that people are you know skepticism is just off the charts uh, these days which is just sad to see um, but it's a reflection of reality that we live in um, but overall i think that it's um yeah this type of news is welcome and it's a really really nice thing to see and it gets me very excited to see like okay what's next in plan for the rata team and their upgradability future proofing and all that kind of stuff because this opens the doors for a lot of interesting and exciting things to implement in their own or your own devices and platforms. So there you go, we now have a DIY do-it-yourself zone for the Supernote. And as I already said, I think that it's an exciting development for the overall platform, although quite, quite pricey like their products were to begin with. So uh, do let me know in the comments down below what your thoughts are, what your opinions are. And I'm also kind of curious, uh, what do you feel about the option of having like, okay, so already now you have the option of buy a 
replacement battery and have it as a spare just in case. And then no matter what, if anything happens to Rata or no, or they stop supplying these things in a couple of years, you have your spare battery and you really don't care for the device itself. Then again, is it worth it? Because are you gonna keep the device for longer than five years or not? Or even more, because these batteries tend to last quite a long time. Also, do let me know what you think about the replacement motherboards. I know that one of the uh, requirements or one of the wishes would be if they would re uh, release a motherboard with a not only a more powerful SoC, but much more importantly, more internal storage, because even though it does have an external uh, storage SD card, the nature of Android is such that it's like really not a friend with external storage uh, class as it looks at it. And as such, it does pose problems in backup and restoring and synchronization of things that you may have used on the external storage. So I do know that the internal storage amount is one of the things that users are definitely looking for. But I'm kind of wondering like, what are the other things that you may find interesting for uh yep yeah, as a replacement motherboard for the manta or the yep yeah, nomad i hope that you found the video informative and or useful if you did please like and subscribe and ding the notification bell in the description below and remember to go to mydeepguy.com shop where you can find mdo and mmp both of which are hyperlinked pdf workbooks that help you organize all of your personal professional organizational or journaling needs and you can find more information about about these products in the description down below. Know that purchasing of these uh, products not only gives you a kick-ass organizer and empowerment to organize all of your yeah, life basically, but you also directly support independence of my deep guide. Thank you so much for watching, stay safe, stay healthy, and see you in the next video. Bye!